Hey, what's up guys? In this video, we're going to talk about functions in C++ programming. The function is a block of code which performs a particular task. And once written, a function can be called many times to perform that particular task. And the syntax of function declaration is, first you have the return type, then the function name, and inside the parentheses, we pass the parameters. And then, inside the curly braces, we write the block of code. And to call the function, the syntax is first we have the function name and then inside the parentheses we pass the parameter list and then we put one semicolon at the end. And this way we can call that particular function and the block of code will be executed. So the main advantages of using function is that code reusability. So once we have written one block of code inside a function, then we can reuse that block of code by calling that function multiple times in our program. Next we have code optimization because we can reuse one particular block of code multiple time. So we have to write less code in our program and that way we can optimize our code. Next we have code readability. So by the use of functions in our program, we can increase the readability of the code. So these are all the advantages of using functions in our program. There are two types of functions available, library function and user defined function. The library functions are predefined in the C++ library and the user defined functions are created by the user. So in this example program, we are going to create one function and we are going to call that function from inside the main method. So to create one function, first we have the return type. So I'm going to write void because this method will not return any value. And then the function name, I'm going to call it display. And then inside the parentheses, we have to pass the parameter list. I'm going to left it blank because this method will not receive any parameter. And then inside the curly braces, we write the block of code. So every time we call the display method, it is going to print the string function called onto the console. Now to call the function, we have to write the name of the function display and then a pair of parentheses. And we have to close that statement with one semicolon at the end. Now in this program, we have created one function called display and whenever we call the function, it is going to print the string function called. So now I'm going to save this program and I'm going to run the program. And you can see we have printed the string function called. So this way we can declare one function and then we can call that function to perform that particular task. So hope you understand the concept. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you.